COPD, also called chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, is a disease which is uh, characterized by airflow limitation. Characterized by persistent or intermittent uh, breathlessness, uh, cough. It can start as early as 40 years old and it can be even found in patients that is 80, 90 years old. Smokers. 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 It's almost always exclusively due to smoking or smoking-related illness. So the common causes of COPD is uh, tobacco smoking. So COPD commonly occur in smokers, especially if they are chronic smokers. So the airway starts from the nose, goes down to the back of the throat, then the voice box, and then go down to the airways. These are, this is your trachea, it's also called a windpipe. This is large airway. The airways branch and keep branching all the way until the periphery. As it keeps branching, it becomes smaller and smaller. These are the ones that are exposed to the toxins. And these get damaged and inflamed, and that's where you have symptoms. For the inhalers, that can be used to uh, open up the airways so that the patient can breathe easily and they feel less breathless. So this is one of the common way of treatment. Most of our patients will be on inhalers and this will help to improve their quality of life. When a patient is diagnosed with COPD, most of the time they will have some degree of uh, shortness of breath and they may have a chronic cough. So usually they will benefit with they they will benefit from the use of a daily inhaler that is that contain airway dilator. The purpose of the inhaler is to open up the airway round the clock so that they don't feel persistent breathlessness and recurrent cough. If they still uh, feeling symptomatic, they're feeling breathless, they have recurrent phlegm, recurrent uh, exacerbation the addition of inhaled steroid may make a difference. So in this group of patients, we'll give them a trial of uh, a new inhaler for three to six months and see how they respond. And there are two groups of drugs which are, are the foundation for treatment of COPD, mainly LAMA and LABA. LABA means long-acting bronchodilator. LAMA means long-acting uh, anticholinergic, also inhaled. So these two drugs are the foundation. So you usually start one, not better, you start with the second one, okay? So, and they are all not combined drugs. And the third group of inhaled medicine will be steroids. And now, we have three-in-one inhalers. Three-in-one helps compliance, uh, in terms of easier to use rather than use three devices. Yes, just like any chronic diseases, uh, COPD, uh, patient on it, uh, with this condition, they suffer for many years. And it is quite difficult for them to uh, repeat the same treatment every day. So that is the one of the best uh, you know, development in terms of treatment to improve the uh, outcome and, and compliance of patients.